Hello again. In this lesson we're going to look at how to play the beautiful song The Dutchman, which was written by Michael Peter Smith back in 1968. It was it went on to be a huge hit in Ireland for Liam Clancy and also for the comedian Brendan Grace. This is another song in our series of lessons on how to play folk songs and ballads and tunes popular in Ireland. Click on the link in the description below to browse the list of 170 or so lessons. Now this song is in the key of C and I'm playing it in the key of C but I'm using the capo on the fifth fret so I'm going to play it using the chord shapes from the, from the key of G. So when I play G that's really C. I'm going to be referring to the chords as their, as their shapes, the shapes I'm playing. So that will be G. Now we have five chords in the song. We have G major, A minor, D major, E minor, and C major. I'm finger picking the song. The song is often played using the finger, finger picking style, the Travis picking. And in Travis picking, we've got a very busy thumb on the right hand side where the thumb is constantly picking between uh, bass notes. And then with my fingers, I'm picking the treble strings to finish the, the pattern. So it would sound like this. the pattern for G. So you can see how busy my thumb is there. I'll upload uh, a lesson or two on Travis picking for those of you who are interested in that. There are also loads of lessons on YouTube how to how to Travis pick. But I'm just going to stick for this lesson again with a nice simple pattern where we pick bass note with the thumb but then my fingers are doing the next three notes so it's one and two and then my thumb is going to pick an alternate bass for the three beat three and four and so it obviously it's in four four time one and two and three and four and thumb thumb sixth string for G fourth string so I'm alternating my thumb between the 6th and the 4th strings. Meanwhile my fingers are picking the pattern in between. 2nd string, 3rd string, 1st string. So just assign your fingers to a string here. 1st finger on the 3rd, 2nd finger on the 2nd, 1st finger, 3rd uh, finger on the 1st. And these, my fingers are picking up. My thumb is picking down, my fingers picking up. So that G chord again is 1 and 2. For A minor, very similar pattern, except this time my thumb is picking the root note again, and this time the root note is on the fifth string. My fingers will pick the same pattern. So I'm alternating my thumb between the fifth string, fourth string. So it's one and two and three and four and fifth string, fourth string. And that's the bar, one and two and three and four and. And the D major chord, my fingers will pick the very same pattern, the only thing will change is the root note for my thumb, the first note, the one beat. One, two, and three, and four, and so you see it's fourth string for one, fifth string for three. One, and two, and three. Um, e, the E minor chord, is like the G chord, we're going to pick the sixth string, because that note is the root note, that note is E. So and it'll alternate, my thumb will alternate between sixth and fourth. One and two and three and four and and the C major chord then, like the A minor chord, my the root note is the fifth string. I'll alternate my thumb between the fifth and the fourth for the first beat, third beat. One, three, 